do a quick review of the beat spices on page 13. Okay, now what we have here are eight ways to spice up a beat. Starting in measure one, I have the riff beat, we'll call it a one two, one of the core 15 beats. In measure two, you can see what's called a compatible beat, or any of the other 14. Uh, a song or a phrase picks out a riff beat, and then we can use any of the other 14 every second measure, which is what's com most commonly uh, used uh, uh, beat spices is, is a compatible beat. Measure three, we have a rest on count three. You can see that that bass drum pulse on count three is missing right here. In measure four, we're, uh, we have left jab number one, uh, number one. That's an extra snare hit on the, on the count of two. In measure five, we have left jab number two, which is an extra snare hit uh, uh, as well on count three. Um, moving on, measure six, we have an open hi-hat. You can see the zero there above the uh, last eighth uh, hi-hat pulse. Um, that's an open hi-hat. The plus means to close it. Measure seven, uh, we have an extra bass drum kick on the last uh, eighth note uh, count on the and of four, commonly used uh, practice. Measure eight, we have a crash cymbal on count four, commonly used practice as well. Uh, and then finally, uh, the last measure, we have an accent on the last count on the and of four. All right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to start, I'm going to play uh, the riff beat uh, first. All right, a compatible beat, the first spice used. And you can see I played a 2-2. Two, two. Uh, in measure one, I played a 1-2. Uh, the second measure, you can see there's more bass drum patterns. It's just busier uh, once you stay with that, that process of simple, busy, simple, busy, uh, and so forth. All right. Measure three, we're going to rest on count three. Measure four, we're going to play left jab number one. Uh, most snare hits are on counts two and four, uh, and what we're doing here is just adding one extra on the second count. Measure five, I'm throwing in another uh, extra snare hit on count three. Moving on to the open hi-hat in measure six. Measure seven, we're going to add an extra bass drum kick, meaning we have a one and then two hits there. We're going to throw one more right there, as you can see it. And then in measure eight, we have a crash symbol on count four. And then finally, we're going to throw in an accent uh, in measure nine on the uh, and of four as well. Good. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to start with the riff beat, and I'm going to play one of the spices uh, every second measure. I'll start with the riff beat and play a compatible beat. And then I'll play the riff beat again and I'll play, uh, I'll utilize a rest on count three. I'll play the riff beat and then left jab one, riff beat, left jab two, riff beat, open hi-hat, riff beat, extra bass drum hit, riff beat, crash cymbal, and then finally riff beat and the accent. That mimics what we're doing in drums, creating two measure mini songs, kind of keep things interesting. All right, let's try it. There you have it.